welcome to the Retro Shared uh, again. Thank you for joining us. Now, we have been home an hour. An hour. <laughs> We've just driven home all the way from Brighton. We've had a cracking weekend, actually, with um, Dean and John and the gang from Press Start to Join. Thank you so much for the invite, guys. Very nice crew. We had a cracking time, although I've got a cracking headache. And do you know why I've got a cracking headache? Because Premier Inn have got a problem with the thermostats in their rooms. Yes. Have they not? Well, I don't see how that would give you a headache. It's called dehydration. I felt yeah, like I've been on a plane for 12 hours. My throat feels really funny. What we did, we, we dialed our room thermometer down to 16, 16 full degrees. Blast. Full blast air conditioning. And the room didn't get any colder than 25. And then we looked at the, the, 24. We, looked, we looked at the stats <laughs> in the next morning. 23 degrees. 24, 25, and I was roasting that. So absolutely roasting. So I've woke up with a cracking headache. Need to drink some water. Anyway, really we hard. digress. Um, yeah, so we've been to Burgess Hill all weekend, uh, taking part in Press Start to Join's gaming event. But unfortunately um, Izzy was too busy. So yeah, Izzy unfortunately couldn't make it. She was busy doing whatever it is Izzy does. Uh, so she Work. didn't, you know, probably working, so she wasn't with us. But we had a great time. It's a, it was uh, it was good fun, actually. Mm. Uh, until you got leery and got us thrown out of the pub. Don't do that again. You'll get me into trouble with Mum. Anyway. Have you saw Mum? I think she does know. She wants to question me. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, moving on. Um, what did you think of it? Well, did you have a good time? Yes, I did. It was great, wasn't it? What did you love about it? I liked exploring around the stage, you went up ladders and stuff. <laughs> no, I'm on about the games. Oh, the games! The games! I like all the challenges they have, like competitions. Yeah, so I like that. that was good. You did quite well at considering he's not played Rocket League for a while. You did quite well, didn't you? Until the final round, and then you got your backside handed to you on a plate. It's only five one. Was it? No, it's not too bad. And you did well. You, do you know what? He was playing, um, oh, what was that game called? Trials HD. Trials HD, which is actually it's a cracking little game, And it's game, the worst it? thing for me, and it's also the best thing. Yeah, you set an absolutely fabulous score of 23-something seconds to finish this course. And a chap called, what was his name? Remember his name? Lewis. Lewis. <laughs> Hello, Lewis. Thank you watching us. Um, absolutely smashed your score and got it down to 22.3 seconds, which... Fair play. That was that was an absolute cracking score. I think you did ever so well. Give him a round of applause. He meant that. You could tell, can't you? Anyway, it was great to see uh, big kids, uh, and, little kids and little kids playing with everything from what um, Atari Twenty Six Hundred upwards. upwards, right up to DS Four. Um, no, no, cracking no, no. weekend. Um, so thank you very much to the guys. That was wonderful. So, uh, we're going to take a look at what we got up to now. How's it going, Dean? How's it going, John? Great, very right. good. What yeah, a yeah. cracking day. Now, Josh looks like a wet lettuce. Well, he's got a face like a slap cop oh, today because he has been trying so hard, haven't you, mate? What have you been trying to do? To beat this time. He's been trying to beat this time. What's the game called? Trials. Trials. Yeah, and he's worked his heart out on this. And to be honest with you, Stu can't get more than 21 seconds. I can't. You can't. So that guy, what was his name? I don't what know. Who's Lewis? Lewis. Lewis. Lewis, you've set Lewis. a fabulous time there. I hope you feel proud of yourself, you upset the kid. Right. 
We just so, God, what were you going to say? I was going to say, you just need a photograph of him now so you can yeah. start dancing. We'll, we'll find out. We'll find out where you live, don't you worry. Um, right, so... Yeah, actually, uh, if he wins, he'll be posted on our website yeah, on so the Champions <laughs> Gallery so you can throw uh, we'll rotten, find out where he rotten fruit at that, Josh. Each day you can go, I have you now. Yes, Lewis, you've started something there, my friend. So. <laughs> anyway, right, so we're with Dina and John from uh, Press Start to Join and we thought we'd do what we normally do in spring some wonderful questions. But before okay. we do that, tell us what you do. What do you guys do? Well, Press start to join uh, we are uh, video game event organisers so obviously today's been one of our public events where we've had around 200 people into the centre in in Burgess Hill Um, and everyone's it's been cracking we've had a great day and we do a lot of other stuff don't we John yeah Yeah, we do uh, we do birthday parties we do um, stag stag parties hen, hen nights Entertainment weddings. Oh, I've got uh, a cracking headache, so it's been a good, good day. That's good, a good, good, good. good day. It's very <laughs> wonderful. So, um, yes, we've got some questions actually for you guys. So, um, which, uh, which for the benefit of the tape, we haven't seen. No, 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 we haven't. No, no, that's true. That is. I'm a little bit nervous about these now. Um, so, as long as it's not the one where babies come from, I'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So Josh has put a few of these together actually. So, um, well, that, well, that's a normal one. Just uh, how long have you guys been doing this? When when did you fa- found? Two and a half years. Yeah. Yeah, it's October 2015. We did our first event here in this location. Yeah, yeah. that was okay, our so first ever event. So you've come back to Roost then, basically. We have, yes, yeah. yes. Okay. What's yeah. your Desert Island arcade cabinet? <laughs> Desert Island arcade cabinet would have to be a sit-down wireframe Star Wars yes. for me. That's has to be that. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly has to be my that. choice as well. Go on then, Jim. Yeah, for me, it's one of two. It's either the original Gauntlet, four player Gauntlet, Ooh. or the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, four player. Oh no. <laughs> Or you can only have one. That, right, okay. Four players. Right, forget those two. Four players. Super Sprint. No. Yeah, yeah. Super Sprint. That's it. Super Sprint. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, you love Super Sprint. Super Sprint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I do like. I, think, I do I think, like the hydraulic outrun as yeah, well. Yeah. But, okay. When you can get in it. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, absolutely nothing to do with referendum. What's your favourite food? I want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Oh, All right, sorry, sorry, Josh. Ask away, mate. What's your favourite food? Do you know what? <laughs> Probably my wife's roast dinner. That is a winner for me. Is that because she's sat she's over sat there? Over there. <laughs> and yeah, good old roast dinner yeah, for me. Yeah, we like mum's roast dinner, don't we? Especially honey carrots. You can't beat honey carrots. Ooh, nice, nice. Mm, roast dinner me, it is. Me, me personally, Shepherd's Pie. Shepherd's Pie? Shepherd's Pie. Oh, okay. Who are your favourite games developers? Oh, crikey. Do you have one particular developer uh, uh, that you... Maybe from way, way yeah. back in the day, it would be someone like Psygnosis for me. Ooh. I it's a little ball. Yeah. 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 Destruction Derby was yeah, yeah. was a great game. Yeah. Maybe even uh, Shadow of the Beast. They're all coming back in there. Maybe further back, someone like Codemasters. Yeah. Who I used to buy. Are they still One ninety nine and two ninety nine Spectrum yeah. games in my local right? newsagent. BMX Simulator. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, that's yeah. Right, Super that's Robin right. Hood. Yeah, yeah. All those games. Okay. What about yeah. yours? Well, well, again, it's going to be a retro one. It'll probably be someone like uh, Imagine. Yes. Uh, Star for Canard, yeah. that sort of thing, or yeah. possibly Ocean, or uh, con- judging by the absolute volume of games I bought for them, is Mastertronic, although I guess they were more a past publisher. They were a publisher. So. Yeah, so, yeah, but yeah, I used to yeah. get an awful lot of games. They are one yeah, 99, 99, 99, 99 Find the Keepers and stuff yeah, exactly, like that. Yeah. 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 Clumsy Colin on his motorbike, that sort yeah. of thing. Oh, Great stuff. Skips, yeah. <laughs> right, go on then, Josh, what's the next question? What's your favourite console? GameCube for me, without oh, a shadow okay. of a doubt. It's not GameCube. many people's favourite, is it? It is a, a much underrated console with some superb games yeah. on it, and also my favourite controller as well. It is a good controller, yeah, actually, yeah. yeah. Just okay. exactly right, yeah. Favourite. It's also Nintendo. Which Switch? one? Super Nintendo. <laughs> Which one? The SNES. The SNES. Yeah. The yeah, Super Nintendo yeah, for me. That's sort of like just a because. It, yeah, I, I, I got a lot of games for that back in the day. Yeah. yeah. Bought one at launch. I couldn't answer that. I don't know what mine is to be honest. I really don't. I love, I love lots of them. <laughs> yeah, PS4. <laughs> modern gamers. Uh, right, okay, going back even further, you think back to the 8 or 16 bit era, what was your favourite home computer? Well, we're going to. Re- this, is, this, is, this divides us. <laughs> yeah. That's we like divisive questions. Yeah, yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. I was a Spectrum child. Okay. No. You've ordered the Spectrum next, have you? Uh, I've got. No, I've got a Spectrum Vega, though. Okay. Which is a bit of yeah. fun. 
Um, we've had we've had that at a couple of events. Yeah. But I would say for me, it would have to be the spectrum. Good old specky. Yeah. yeah. Pregnant calculator itself. Yeah. 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 Jetpacks were incredibly popular. Yeah. 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 Jet do a jetpack challenge. Jetpack challenge. Yeah. And that's a imagine, isn't it? Ultimate play. Yes. Yes, it was. Yeah. Yeah. It's on the rare replay it released yeah. as well, actually. Yeah. Which is quite good. So what's your favourite? What's, what's yours? Oh, you see, I was Commodore 64 through and through. Christmas, 1982, oh, me and my brother's yeah. got given one. Do you head to head, really, with Spectrum? Absolutely. Yeah. It's like playground all over again. Yeah. Yeah. Who had, who had <laughs> the best of course, I went, I went to Amiga, he went to ST. Yeah. So, uh, to be honest, yeah, yeah. we're a bit head to head. <laughs> All the way through, yeah. it, it, okay. it, and it's what makes. I mean, you're an ST. I can see a fight going to break. I think, it, <laughs> I, think, I think it's what makes this work. Yeah. Because if someone, so John's talk, talking to me about, oh, someone, you know, I'm talking to someone about Commodore. Yeah. Oh, you need to talk to John. Yeah. If someone comes to talk to you about Spectrum, I'm going to talk to him. Yeah. And, and, it, no and it works like that on some of the other machines yeah. as well. It kind of oh, filters through, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. Yeah, so that rivalry has lasted all from childhood yeah. right up to present day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Have you read Ready Player One yet? I am on chapter seven right now. Chapter 24. And I finished it. So ah, okay. Ah, right. okay. Now, yeah. as soon as I've finished American Gods, that's my next book to Ready read. Player One. I think it's going to be a big film, really big film of 2018. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Spielberg, is Directed it? by Spielberg yeah, yeah. himself. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. The best and worst thing about modern yeah. gaming. Yeah. Best, it's not the best. Best thing about modern gaming. Skyrim VR. Yeah. I absolutely yeah. love Skyrim VR. Okay. I, I spent... I've, this is the third incarnation of Skyrim I now own, yeah. and I spent on the 360 I clocked up about 120 hours. Okay. On the Xbox One I clocked up, not listening, uh, about 200 <laughs> hours. And I've just I got given she gave my other half gave me Skyrim VR on PS4 for Christmas, and I'm already on about 40 odd hours, and I haven't done any missions yet. So it's um, well, we're gonna that's what I love. I it's like the Skyrim. immersion because yeah. I I think the potential for VR. When I was younger, when, um, most of our generation, were, and I'm sure your dad will say, when we were kids, Star Wars came out, all you wanted to do was fly an X-Wing fighter, right? With PlayStation VR on the VR mission on Battlefront, you can do that. And it is as good as you imagine it will be. It really is good. Yeah. So that's what I love. That is good. Best thing about gaming? Best thing about gaming, for me, it would be... Uh, the Uncharted series. Oh right, yeah, I, I, yeah. I, I played my way through those. Yeah, really, just I thoroughly. Get, I never finished it, but it, yeah. As a, as a as a kind of visual and sensory yeah. experience, a great series of games. Yeah. Loved them. Yeah. Okay. Loved them. Worst thing. Mm. You want to go first? Now this is a toughie because this is either all the uh, paywalls, the DLC, or that sort of stuff where you go, hey, you've just bought this game, but if you want pay to play it properly, more. yes, pay some more money and yeah. give us a kidney. Yeah. Um, or <laughs> It's the tweaking they keep doing to the Xbox One and the PS4. It's sort of, hey, look, we've got the Xbox One. Now we've got the Xbox One S. Now we've got the Xbox version 2.8. Uh, right, now okay. we've got the Xbox Paperclip. And each yeah. time, they, they, it's just more ways to get money. Okay, I appreciate the technology is moving at an incredibly fast rate. Yeah. It's just, no. Give it us six, seven years, You'd then go on to the... You'd see a whole refresh of the generation yeah, exactly. console okay. rather than just rehashing it's, the old one. It is. It's, yeah. it's, um, it's not a case of, right, we, you're going to have that for seven years, then we're going to come up with something yeah. else. It's, right, you'll have that two years, then we'll come up with something yeah, else. Yeah, I've heard that before, actually. So yeah. it's... Uh, that's, that's, yeah, that's, that's a good point. I do find that <laughs> quite irritating. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so your worst thing. thing. I would say that having done events like this where we put out... Retro oh, I know where he's going. Console. Console. <laughs> yeah. It's the absolute lack of just plug and play. Yeah. Everything in the new systems either needs to be installed or an update needs to be downloaded, or you can't yeah. play this game until you you've done something connection. online. Yeah, and it just yeah. seems to, to 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 reduce the control you've got yeah. over your own games. Yeah. And I think that's that's, yeah. that's another thing is the lack of LAN capability there yeah. for PS4 and Xbox One. Because yeah. we used to have with the original Xbox. All pile around someone's house, yeah. and we'd somehow squeeze sixteen of us in. Yeah, it's a great four. social aspect. Yeah, of gaming, absolutely. Wasn't it? And That's what this is all about. Yeah. It's social games. It's getting people back together, being in a room and playing games. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so now I'm going to hit you with this one. Uh. Right, you can go back to any year you like. What year would you go back to, and why? Keep it clean. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> For me, it's going to be right. I'm going to work out the years now. It's 19, working out the years. Isn't 1993. It? Ooh, nice. Because okay. that's the year I turned 17, 
Yeah. Uh, so I know I'm showing my age now. Yeah. Uh, so I could drive. I wasn't old enough to drink, so there was the risk element in all that. Uh, hopefully my father won't see this. But that was the sort of golden age of Amiga. 93, yeah. Yeah, Go and the PlayStation was... I'm not sure it came out yet, actually. Two years off. Yeah. Two years off, So, yes. But it was... I had so much fun with my uh, Amiga. Yeah. What Cruise for a Corpse, uh, Maniac Mansion, yeah. uh, F-18 Hornet. Monkey Island. Oh, Monkey Island, yeah. <laughs> All that stuff, for me, is my favourite time of gaming. Yes, C64, brilliant, yeah, I grew up with that. Yeah. But I really got to appreciate gaming with my Amiga. Okay. Well, absolutely. Go on. I think the year would be... What year, what year did the SNES come out? 1990. Oh, you've got me there. It'll be the year before. Oh, I you. think it was 92. Yeah, so it I might be it was 92. It'll be 93. 91. It was towards the end of the Amiga's life because yeah. it started to kick the Amiga around right. big time. Yeah. Yeah. I, had a, I had a friend who worked in a place where they would test and put the kite mark on items. Okay. Right? Yeah. And he brought back this lump of plastic yeah. that he said to us, Come and have a look at this. You'll never believe yeah. what this what is. What this can do, yeah. And he was testing. Um, plastics and paints on it yeah and it was a SNES and it had Super Mario World in it so we were playing that six away. months to a year before it came out so I think it's that's for me was when um, got right back into into gaming okay, so, so pretty question. much the same year then actually yeah. 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 One year off. Yeah. last question if you guys quit your daytime job and do your press art stuff full-time would you yes absolutely yeah. absolutely yeah. Yeah. I've yeah. met we We've met so many different people, such yeah. as yourselves, which we never would have met had we yeah. not done this. So, and it's can I just make it clear that that's not a resignation? <laughs> no, 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 no. From me. Absolutely. Absolutely not. It's a luxury job. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Well, they sell themselves those things. It's, anyway, not, it's, so, not, yeah. it's not a resignation at all. My name is Bernard but, White, really. <laughs> but we have done, we've, we've, met, we've met a great bunch of people, and this has been a hobby that's escalated. Yeah. And who knows where it will go from here. Yeah. yeah, wonderful. Yeah, it's well, been great. What a cracking day we've had. Um, good, good. Yeah, and I think please. it's time for a bit of curry, isn't it? So. It will be, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Burgess Hill's finest <laughs> <laughs> India garden. Get that time beaten. Right, so you can get that time beaten. So thank you very much you for watching this minutes. once again. And uh, <laughs> I'll see you later, Josh. <laughs> Come back for some more trials yeah, HD. So, yeah, thank you very much, gents. It's been, no it's been good. Thanks, Thanks for coming. So, uh, coming. It's yeah. uh, back to the shed. Um, <laughs> and don't forget to join us next time when we're looking at. Oh yeah, well remembered. We're looking at the cam cam com. Cam Capcom. Cam cap cap Capcom. I'll get me coat. Um, Capcom, Capcom classic yeah. Ghosts and Goblins Ghouls and Ghosts, Ghosts and Ghouls and which is one of the toughest games of all time of all time it's very very difficult uh, so uh, yeah we met some great people we met loads of people spoke to loads of people nice crisps. Um, some of them sub what? nice crisps nice crisps I'm on about people oh, they gave us free crisps yeah Dean gave us some crisps as well so thanks for feeding us as well Dean that was great um, yeah we met some uh, some of our subscribers which was yeah, great did. it's always great to talk to you so people getting recognised in the public as well yeah which is hey you're the retro shirt yeah a bit strange that is isn't it I'm not it used to that it's weird yeah 